The Butte College women's basketball team hit the road to compete in the 3C2A Elite Eight. And sports director Jenna Fink caught up with the Roadrunners as they left campus today. So, Jenna, this is their second straight Elite Eight appearance, is that right? That is right, Haley and Allen. They're quickly turning into a basketball powerhouse. The Butte players and coaches thrilled to make the Elite Eight again, but they're hungry for more. They're chasing their first state championship since 1983. I knew from the very beginning that this was going to be a good season. Perhaps a bit better than good, Butte College women's basketball won its third straight conference title and is back in the Elite Eight. A year ago today, we were more worried about the banquet thing that we got to <laughs> go to later. The Roadrunners lost to Irvine Valley in that game last year. This season, the message to freshmen like Madeline Bassett is simple. You know, the banquet's fun, it's cool to go to, it's nice to get dressed up, but we're not here for that, we're here for the W. It isn't just Butte's mindset that has changed. We have a lot of girls that can shoot the ball. Um, our inside game has also improved um, dramatically. The Roadrunners put that improved offense to the test all season. We played the tough schedule in the state this year uh, by our RPI. We're the number one in the state, and we're playing some of the best basketball of our, our season right now that uh, we have a great chance to go make some noise. Butte's first chance to do that tomorrow against Cypress College. They press. Um, they sit in a 2-3 zone, and they're active, you know, so we've got to make shots and take care of the ball. Um, but, uh, you know, we have great ball handlers. We have great shooters this year. We have a little bit of everything. If we play the way we played against Merced, no one can stop us. In total, three games stand between the Roadrunners and their first state championship since 1983. Just stay locked in, stay focused, like don't play, don't play too, out of your, like, too out of your minds, like do what we do and we'll be all right. We know that if we just stick together and take care of our bodies, rest our minds, and just, you know, do what we've been doing this whole season and not let it get to us, I, I know we can do it. Butte tips off in the Elite Eight tomorrow at 5 o'clock, and there are a ton of local players on this team. Four from Chico, Paradise Willows, Weaverville, and Corning also represented. Good luck to them. Yeah.